Hello, this video is about PAVM's passive accessory intervertebral motion technique. And this patient here <laughs> is having trouble extending her neck. She has pain. We measured her extension and it only will go to 30 degrees. Is that true, patient? Yes, that's true. So <clears throat> the technique that we're going to show hopefully will help, one, decrease her pain, and two, um, increase the mobility into extension. So, Elle, I just want to describe to you what, what we're going to try out here today and how it works. So, this is, these are the bones in your neck, and um, when you go to look up, the top bone here slides down and back on the bone underneath it. So, um, what this technique does is I'm, I'm going to press on the spinous process of that bone and help you get some more mobility. Since you're in a lot of pain at first, we're just going to start with what's called grade one and two techniques. And that will just be a very light pressure. And for the physical therapists watching, um, that light pressure is just supposed to help stimulate mechanoreceptors and increase blood flow and synovial fluid flow to the area, which has been shown to decrease pain. So we would start with that since she's in a lot of pain. And after some time, if the pain decreases, um, in a couple of weeks or a week, we'll move on to grades three and four. And in that case, we're going to actually start to move into the barrier restriction and, and go a little bit further to actually help the bones move. Okay? Okay. So if I did a grade three, um, we would come into the barrier restriction and out of it again. So I would go into where I feel resistance and I'd release. With a grade four, I'd go into where I feel resistance and I would stay there and just do small pulses and try to create more motion um, so that you can get more cervical extension this way. Okay, uh, we're going to begin the treatment. Okay. And we're going to start here with a grade one mobilization. So, when we were examining Elle's neck, we found that most of her pain seemed to be coming from between C5 and C6. So we'll focus on C5 here. So we'll move up, finding the spinous process of C5. And then we're just going to begin with a very, very light pressure here. This is grade one. And we would pulse here for 30 seconds. And we'd do a couple rounds of 30 seconds. And then we'd sit up and reassess her pain and her ability to extend. Grade two, we'll take it a little deeper, if that's the grade that we felt was appropriate. Grade three, I have come into that barrier of extension. Press in and release from the barrier. And grade four, we'll find that barrier and we'll stay in there, increasing the extension. And all those grades would be for 30 seconds. We try a couple rounds of that and then sit up to reassess her extension ability. How are you feeling there? Great. While I was uh, performing the PAVM, um, I'm using a, a posterior to anterior motion coming through the pads of my thumbs on the spinous process. And um, grades one and two are just getting at, um, again, mobilizing some synovial fluid and some blood to the area to help relieve pain. But when you get into grades three and four, um, you're helping to open up the capsules. So you may be um, helping some ligaments to open up, some muscles to relax if they're in spasm. Um, and also any adhesions that might be around the joint capsule can start to be broken up with the grades three and four with that P to A pressure, posterior to anterior pressure. After our treatment, we re-examined Ella's neck. And on the first day of treatment, her range of motion may not improve, but she did report that she had a, a decrease in pain. Right? Yes. <laughs> and every time we do a treatment, uh, we do two or three rounds of the technique, and then we stop and check in with the patient and see if we've made a difference. 
And that's how you know how long you should do the technique for, how long the patient should keep coming to therapy. If they increase their range of motion back to a functional level and their pain goes down to whatever level they desire it to go down to, then you know you're done.